Oh, there we go. It's working. Hi, everyone. My name is Tara, and I just wanted to hop on live and talk a little bit about myself. Um, so I share a lot of my life and my relationship online. And the reason I do that is because I really want to promote transparency about what having an open relationship is like and female sexual empowerment. And um, I just really enjoy giving women and men that, that gift of knowing they can they can ask for what they want and that it's okay. And um, a big part of living in an open relationship and in the lifestyle is being um, authentic, being authentic to yourself, to what you want as an individual, to what you crave, to what you desire. And sometimes that can be a really hard thing for people to even become aware of. Um, so for me, um, one thing I wanted to also talk about is that although the lifestyle promotes like this very empowering, very sex positive atmosphere of being yourself, a lot of people hide it as well. And they hide it from their friends and they hide it from their family and they, they basically hide it that side of their life. So in one sense, you're able to open up and be yourself and find all these great things out about you, but you also are living it in a secret. So um, I think that is a huge thing that the lifestyle has been teaching me in the last, I'd say, couple weeks, um, is how I, I don't live authentically. Like, yes, I, I definitely share a lot of myself, but I mean, it's not something I share with my family and it's not something I share with, um, with James family. And uh, I decided I needed to change that. And a reason for that was because we did have some close friends in the community pass and it really opened my eyes up to their family didn't even know half of who they were. and. It was really surreal sitting at their funeral and it was, it was sad. And I just, I left feeling like I, I don't want it to end that way for me. And it's something that um, really spoke to me. So I'm gonna cry. <laughs> so I started opening it up more to my family. I shared a lot with my sister to start with. Um, my brother kind of knew a little bit like about our business and everything. And my sister took it well. She even said that she was going to help out because she specializes in marketing and communications. So it went, it went really good. And then um, I went for, for lunch with my mom and we don't, we don't talk that much. And she um i ended up telling her like quite a bit about about what we we do what we promote events we put on people that we help and just how rewarding it was for me and honestly like she took it fine like she didn't have an issue with it she didn't look down at me like i was scum she just was like okay that's not really for me. I probably would just want a cabin in the woods away from everyone, but she didn't like disown me and it surprised me because that's not what I was expecting. And um, it was really powerful to just get it out there and, and start being who I am to everyone. Um, you know, I, I don't know if you if you're not living in your truth like do you want to give me a little heart or something so I know that I wasn't alone in that for so long I don't know it was it was tough um, I still haven't really spoke to my dad about it but I think he actually knows more than my mom did so um, but yeah I just wanted to, to share a little bit about 
living in, in your truth and honoring that and understanding that this lifestyle, it gives you gifts of helping you become aware of who you are. And I think slowly over time, people, they accept it more and more. And I just want to just share that it's okay. And I appreciate everyone who tuned in. So thank you, you guys. And I'll be on live soon again.